Good evening and welcome to the pit of ultimate darkness. I am your host, Manservant Hecubus. I know you are accustomed to seeing Sir Simon Milligan, master of funk and evil. But today, or tonight, Master is on honeymoon in the seventh circle of hell with his wife and mother-in-law. But here I am for tonight, ready to serve him and Satan. Tonight, I am answering questions from the death tag. Question number one. How do you want to die? Well, that's a very interesting question. How can you die when you are already dead? But I guess if I had to do it all over again, I wouldn't change it for the world. Being shot 36 times by that lovely but creepy chicken lady while Cabbage Patch Head is smoking a Cuban and laughing hysterically in the background. Such a peaceful death. Question number two. What will happen to your YouTube channel? Well, this YouTube channel will quite probably be undead as I am and remain so until another version of YouTube emerges. Yes, sort of like a reincarnation, if you believe in that type of things. Question number three. Who will you leave your money to? Well, on the matter of money, how can I say this? Um, I don't have any. You see, being technically a spirit, I do not need to get any material things. That would be quite stupid. Not to mention ironic. Also, Master is very good to me. And following the rule of me being a manservant. I do not get any wages. But if I did have some money, I guess I would give it to Master, considering he already possesses everything I used to own and that includes my soul obviously question number four what will happen to your body well pretty much the same as usual I guess roaming castles in the middle of the night yanking chains Pretty much freaking people out. Tried and tested. It works. Question number five. What do you want your funeral to be like? Well, 
This question brings back so many memories. You see, I was an orphan. I never really had any friends. I didn't have a job, so nobody turned up to my funeral. The grave digger just tossed me in an open trench and completely forgot about me. The priest got bored halfway through and couldn't be bothered finishing. <laughs> Excuse me, I do get emotional sometimes. <sighs> Question number six. What will you miss the most that will exist after your death? Frankly, nothing. Being dead has been the highlight of my life, so to speak. And last question, number seven. How will you want to be remembered? Well, I'm pretty sure those old white ladies those little kids will remember my apparitions. I do try my best to scare them when they least expect it. It's so much fun. The look on their face is priceless. Well, that's about it. Thank you for joining us tonight, and if you haven't done so already, please call your mum. Good night.